Hi viewers, it's um, Molly Kotchik. Um I hope you guys are all having a great summer. I know I have been trying to stay cool through this crazy heat wave Pennsylvania is facing, but this week we hope that it's been it's going to be cooler. Um, I would just like to apologize for um, not doing a video for four weeks. I know it's been a month, and I do apologize. Um, I tried to do one a couple of weeks ago, but the video had no sound, and then I tried to do one again, and then my phone was acting up, but that is no excuse, and I hope that this video um, gets on. Oh, so, so sorry. I just... I just got up. For those of you who don't know, I do work night shift, but um, it's a job for right now. Um, for those who have went to the NSA conference, I hope you enjoyed your time there. I do wish I would have been able to go, but because of me going to nursing school in August, um, I didn't have the funds to go. But I was told that. Next year is going to be in Washington, D.C., and that's in my backyard. It's about four hours, so that's a lot cheaper to travel than it is to Arizona. But those of you who went, um, from your post on Facebook, I heard it was an amazing time, and then a lot of you have learned a whole lot. Um... Talk about my stuttering for the past month. Well, a lot has gone on. Like, um, it being hot and it being really hard for me to breathe because my asthma and just, sorry, just situations that have um, happened th throughout the past month. My stuttering has been okay. I have been caught on a couple, um, words and I realized when I say thank you I have to put an S in front of it because it says thanks because it's harder it's easier I don't know but some people look at me like I have two heads and I'm like uh oh well it's this is who I am and I stutter and I'm I'm okay with it and the people who around me who who aren't just have to de uh, deal um, but I want to know, when you meet new people, do you, after talking to them for a couple minutes, do you automatically tell them, hey, I have a stuttering problem, I'm not on on drugs or I'm not crazy? Do you feel like you have to explain yourself? I have been doing that for the past couple weeks or months, and I feel that Really, I don't need to explain myself unless they are giggling, laughing, or doing some kind of different comment. Um, I feel that my I feel that I only need to do that if I feel like the person is either making fun of me, a or B, I feel like my stuttering is kind of severe at the time that I need to explain. Um, I was at Dorney Park, an amusement park, with a friend of mine, and I went to order something to eat, and the girl kind of laughed at me. And my one, my friend uh, um, looked at me, and I'm like, it's okay, I got this. And I told the person, like, um, excuse me, I have a speech problem. Please don't laugh at me. And she was really, really sorry. And I did it in a nice manner, which usually I usually chew the person's head off. But I was actually, it was hot, which I'm surprised I did not chew her head off. We went pretty much on the hottest day of the year. Bad choice. But I did it in a manner that it was polite. And I told him, like, excuse me, this is how I talk. Please don't uh, um, uh, do that. Because the, I feel like because 1% of people have that stutter, like, the other percent, 99%, a lot of them don't know what it is. And so 
you need to be nice about it and there's sometimes that I'm not there's sometimes I chew people's head off and I am sorry I do that because I don't like to be I'm sorry oh my gosh I keep yawning because I don't want to be mean I don't want to be rude about it but I also want to be like hey this is this is who I am but blah 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 I keep on going on about this same topic but um, let me know what you think. L let me know that if you feel the same way, if you feel like you need to explain that you have a stuttering problem when you first meet new people, or if you just let whatever happens, happens. And if they bring it up, then you explain it. Also, um, I realized when I talk to kids, they kind of not more so laugh but they're very curious because you know kids they are very curious and I like to explain to them hey this is how I t talk and and they always ask me why well I tell them well you know what there are people in the world who had disabilities or people in the world who were special I'm one of those people who have a, a little hard time talking and that makes me special they're like oh okay they're like you have a super power I'm like yeah pretty much but with kids you can just go with the flow go with the flow but um but um I hope you enjoyed this video again I'm very sorry it took me four weeks or three weeks to do one I hope this video um uploads if I'm having a problem with the volume again, please let me know via Facebook or message me on YouTube and I will hopefully fix it. But remember, you all have a voice and you all are special in your own way. Um, keep talking and keep on, um, keep on pressing new boundaries, keep on going outside of your comfort zone. I hope you all have a great week, and I will try to do one next week. Have a good day, week, and take care. Bye, guys.